Xiaomi's first attempt at EVs comes with impressive specs and up to 664 horsepower. The petty grudges between Tesla Model S and Porsche Taycan that have been going on for the last few years are moving to a new dimension for 2024. This replacement is called the Xiaomi SU7, and it's the first example to come from a company that's known mostly for its smartphones, though. There are seriously ambitious plans in the automotive industry. You'll remember that we reviewed the SU7 back in November, when we took a detailed look at the electric sedan for the first time, along with a few key technical details, thanks to an information sharing by China's Ministry of Industry and Information Technology, MIIT. But today Xiaomi officially unveiled the SU7, revealing everything from its power lineup to its driving range to the clamping force of the casting machine used to build it, up to 2 million pounds, 9,100 tons. For example, we now know that at 196.7 inches, 4,997 millimeters long and with a 118.1 inch, 3,000 millimeters, wheelbase, the SU-7 is much larger than both of its key rivals and has an incredibly slippery, McLaren-style nose. It gives a drag coefficient of only 0.195. The Medina architecture is compatible with both 400 and 800 volt electricity, and there are multiple drive configurations and power outputs available for motors cheekily, and confusingly, called V6, V6S, and V8S. Base V6 cars have a single engine and send 295 horsepower, 299 PS 220 kilowatts, and 295 LBFT, 400 newton meters of torque to the rear wheels, getting you to 100 kilometers per hour in 5.28 seconds. The entry-level model is limited to 400 volts of electricity, so it won't charge as quickly as its more expensive siblings, but it still offers a useful electric range of 415 miles, 668 kilometers from a 73.6 kilowatt hour battery. Top end V8S, on the other hand, our dual motor, producing 664 horsepower, 673 PS 495 kilowatts, capable of accelerating from 0 to 62 miles per hour in 2.78 seconds and reaching a top speed of 165 miles per hour, 265 kilowatts, which beats the Taikung. Kmauer. They also have a driving range of 497 miles, 800 kilometers, on a full charge of their 101 kilowatt hour battery, that's more than the Model S can manage. Fast 800 volt charging technology means you can add 137 miles, 220 kilometers, of range in 5 minutes or 242 miles, 390 kilometers, in 10 minutes when connected to a suitable fast charging station. Xiaomi's SU7 will surpass Taikung, Tesla Model S. Unsurprisingly, given Xiaomi's track record, the SU7 excels in technology, both in terms of driver support and infotainment, headlined by a 16.1-inch central touchscreen. The autonomous package consists of LiDAR, cameras and radar, initially offering unintrusive highway driving and automatic parking, but could expand the self-driving element to city streets after testing in 2024. The only thing Xiaomi didn't fully disclose was the cost, but CEO Lei Jun admitted it wouldn't be cheap, it's not like you'd expect any rival to the Porsche Taycan to be cheap. We'll learn prices as well as details on which countries outside of China will get their hands on the SU-7 in the next few months. Unfortunately, it looks like the USA will not be among them.